Hey guys, we back with another video. I'm just posting and posting like I got an audience. <laughs> Let's speak it into existence. Shout out to Summer Fridays for the hydrating lips and Arterium been in a rotation all week ever since the Sephora sale what did you guys get did anybody get anything in particular is there still something you want to get I don't know if they're going to have another sale I feel like Alta will before them so keep that in mind I know the first thing I'm going to buy is this if you saw my last video you know why because I went from here here washing beauty blenders <sighs> Whew, but I had it for a year thank goodness I ain't got no booger because I'm up close and personal hold on yeah I'm trying to be one of those people that has the girls kind of secured because I'm trying not to make this a long video like I'm literally just going to show you what I do to maintain my wig to the best of my ability. Am I the best? No. But you will need these three on both sides. And one of these for the bang. So, for the bang, you need this. Um. I'm looking at a message of <laughs> people these days. I tell you. So you just find the bang, which is about um nope, too long, too long, too long. Too long. So yeah, here. So this is the bang on this side. And he trying to join, but that's not the bang. So you just smooth it out to the best of your ability. And let me see, because it looks like something got well longer. Okay, maybe not. And you just smooth it out. And you take the roller. I'm going to lean back a little bit. Because I just don't hang out position, right? The great. But we move. You tr you want to do this as neat as possible. Because the neater you roll, the less frizz you will experience. At least for me, anyway. And this side look easier because you already can see it. Because, like, this side too long. So... Yeah, the bang yang um, don't necessarily like be that long. So it's not necessarily curtain bangs, but it's just face framing layers. And like I said, as you roll, keep it taut as you can and keep rolling down. And like I said, roll smoothly so you minimize the amount of frizz. And sometimes I put a little oil, but it's weave, so you, you really don't need to do that. I don't recommend that. So then I look at my hair, see if it's even on both sides. You want to have an even amount of hair. Yeah, something like that. Tuck that in. Y'all need to. So, I start from the back, and I took a good amount because I wanted it to be a body wave. So, a little more. Oh. Uh, like a smidge more. Yeah, about here. And then I take a brush that for a wide to comb. We just took a wide to comb because we already brushed it. So, we want to make sure we get all the knots. Less apple sauce, the better. 
And we're just going to quickly do this because I'm sleepy. And it's only 5 o'clock where I'm at. But it's because of the weather and the time zone change. So that's why I'm kind of sleepy. So. And you want to roll it as taut as you can like you did the bang game. And you just want to go down. And like I said, the neater you roll it, the less fresh you will experience when you unravel it. And I like mine tight because I be twisting and turning at work on the machine, going back and forth from the machine to the container, trying to um, do my job. And honestly, as you can see, these edges is edging. <laughs> I do not too much worry about the edges. So yeah. So you just smooth it out as best as you can. And it is more layers on this side. So you try to get all the little flyaways as you can. And you just take another roller. Why am I flashing y'all? Lord, help me. Uh, that's what I said we gotta do this quickly. Cause the roll was playing peekaboo and the roll was it's 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 felony real bad so yeah we are already on the second roller so we make a progress because when it's fresh curls it's a little harder like i said i got it all the way up here oh it fell but um uh, let me see okay okay wait yeah okay Maybe it's a little too much. But the middle, I don't need like the back in the middle. Well, the back in the front to be tight. The middle can be a little looser. So roll it as best as you can. And you just flip it over like that. And go. I don't know up like this see we got shorty short daddy and you want to just get it along the rod as best as you can roll it inward that's what I do to get it to when it falls it goes backwards see what I'm saying oh my gosh this is why you can't be nude up under here so yeah oh look at that we're not gonna worry about that we're not gonna worry about that it's the layers and you see my band so we just gonna keep rolling we're gonna use a new one this time and this one a little shorter so you probably can see it a little better and this is how I do heatless curls because I do not like too much heat on my hair or my extensions aka wig I do plan on getting another wig I just don't know where and I don't know what kind of hair or style. Speaking of Bob, some people was telling me to get um, a curly hair wig. Something you could just wash and go. But that'll make me sick because I have sinuses sometimes. So as you get closer, just roll it over. And you want to hold it as you roll it. And so you might have to go a little slower as you get up closer to the nape well not the nape but the temple see we already down one side look at that Whew. yesterday I did this yesterday on the live it was an hour long I do not know why the flyaways don't bother me because no, nobody ever see it and yeah so we just gonna kill two birds in one stone, brush all this as 
best as we can. And I do like to unravel it with a little prayer serum or just a serum in general, like bio silver, just something to help with the press. And it does shed, but it's here. You know, it's human hair. I'm not gonna lie, it's human hair. It is going to shed. So keep that in mind. Um, I don't get mad when it sheds. Only thing I get mad about is straggly ends. Truthfully. Yeah, straggly ends. Um, that that get on my nerves. Sometimes, like, see, they just bounce back. See what I'm saying? But anyway, we're not trying to make this too long. It's already 10 minutes. <laughs> so we just do the same thing on this side. Yep. And comb it out one more time. And I don't need to oil my scalp because I did it yesterday <laughs> on the live. <laughs> I wanted to post it, but it was so long. It took so long to process. And, um, it just never worked out. It was draining my battery trying to charge and upload that live. So, we're just going to start keeping it short. Or maybe I just talk too much. <laughs> I'm convinced. I talk too much. Yeah, that's probably what it is. So, we just roll it. And sometimes you just, you know, keep rolling. Get as tight as you can. And like I said, fold it inward. It's going to look like a little Princess Leia vibes. Best as you can. If you know, you know. If you don't know what that is, you do not need to be on my page. Because at least I know what that is. So, yes. You know. Let me see. What else? I got it. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, okay. Anyway, anyway. <sighs> that was funny. At least to me. <laughs> At least to me. That was funny. It's not too often I can say something like that. Because, woo child. 90s versus what y'all got now. I still want to do a 90s party because my mom was graduated in the 90s. We want to tell her age. <laughs> but does that mean I'm telling my age? I don't know. Um, why am I flashing, y'all? <laughs> I'm so glad I got on clothes. <laughs> At least undergarments. Yeah, like I said, it do shed, but I ain't worried about it. It's not like all over the hair. It's, it's two 20s and an 18, so and the closure is 20, but it's it's not heavy layers, but they do got layers to an extent. So we just, we take our time on this side because this side likes to surprise me and unravel as I'm rolling down the river of this rod. And I used to use smaller rods, but I used too many. And um, it take a little longer to fall, and I don't like that. Because too many tight curls makes me look really young. And we're trying to do, not necessarily grown and sexy, but grown and classy. You know what I'm saying? And see, we are already down to the last ride. And I always be thinking, like, I'm going to buy some more. <laughs> or, like, um... Yeah, I'll be thinking something like that. Like, let's see what this was right there. Oh, it's all okay. Okay, yeah, she did trim right there, so it's okay. I don't need to trim. I'm going to put these up. I don't like trimming my bundles, personally. I don't like doing it myself. I'd rather my hairstylist do it. Shout out to God for letting me say I got a hairstylist. Because some people be doing their own hair on here. And, and there's nothing wrong with that. But... As long as I, I I don't have kids, somebody gonna do my hair. The minute I start having kids or I, I get married or something, it's probably when I start back doing my own hair. But until then, it's 
somebody else gonna brush this head but yeah i got a trim a scalp detox and a hot oil treatment a deep condition treatment and i got a braid down and i got my wig installed last friday it took some hours but it was well worth it everybody was patient and not judging and not forcing me to cut off more hair than necessary and everybody that worked on my hair was somebody of color which is awesome you know um this one like i said because it's layers it doesn't really goes up the shaft like that see why because it unravels too much so i might have to redo this real quick and usually if i just put it in there for like a minute or two it just snaps back to life it just like go back to being curls like not to say the curls fail they feel really pretty you know like i got a lot of compliments i've been getting a lot of compliments with this color and stuff color combination i wouldn't say it's out of my comfort zone i just know i wouldn't do it with my natural hair truthfully um she has it's starting to unravel real bad i'm not really sure why let me see if I can tighten it. Nope. Can't do it. Okay, let's try it from the other end. Okay, that's better. So I think it's probably time for some more ropers. I've been putting it off. And um, it's starting to show that I need some another set of rollers. Because they're not rolling as good as I like. But I had these for a while. I think I had them since like February or March. So it's approaching a year or whatever. And, um, like I said, you want to get it as tight as you can if you want the curls to last all day. If you're sitting at a desk or something along deadlines, um, you should be fine with a looser curl. So like this one, we're not gonna redo. We're just gonna take. Uh huh. Yep. Gonna take one of these. See, see, all this peekabooness. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus. I'm not gonna say Jesus because Jesus didn't do it. And I'm not trying to flash y'all. We just gonna roll it to the best of our ability. I might even take a roller. Let me see if I got a roller. But no. Nah. Um, let me see. Yeah, do it up here. Yeah. See, let me see. Once you get the hang of it, you can start doing it real fast. Like 20 minutes is real good because when I first started doing this with a sewing, you can take me. Yeah, you can take me so long. And, um, yeah, it took me so long to do this. But, um, I'm going to show you the oils and the sprays I use and stuff. So, bio silk for the extensions. Um, anti itch spray for in between the scalps, the nape, and temples. And then, as far as. Oh, okay, I gotta be careful with the 
because I ain't got my case on. So, these are the oils. I, I actually ain't got fucking hair on. <laughs> Y'all embarrassing me. <sighs> okay. Um, wild growth for the edges and in between the hair. Peppermint for I use both. Peppermint oil or aloe vera oil is really good too. But you see how much I use and I use this more than anything. So yeah. And I also like this. I ain't gonna show it too much because I got hair on it. But carry care stick. You know. For flyaways for the main game. I did that yesterday too. And I have Color Wild in this conditioner in here. So if I do it myself, like if I want to straighten it, I use this. Truthfully. Oh, and it's all on my page, but this is the spray. Ooh, hold on. This is the spray. Yeah, this is the spray I use for my hairline to keep it in place. So, because I already did it, it is not lifting that bad. <laughs> We're not going to do what we did last night. Um, I, I have a whole life about it. But I believe it. So, y'all don't know what I'm talking about. So, we just going to do it lightly. And this is the bonnet I use. I have three bonnets. I'm part of the bonnet game. Um, I had this one for a little minute. I think this is my first one since doing sew-ins, actually. So, yeah. I like them really tight because I don't like them to be uh, getting wet in the shower. Truthfully. I don't know. The braid. The back clip. The only thing I would say about a wig that's a little troublesome is the back clip. Yeah, the back clip. And, yeah, so it's time for me to wind down. And the flyaways, I try not to worry about them because they're... I tried to tuck all this in and I really shouldn't. I should get a bigger bonnet like a large so this is a medium and this is a large no this is a medium and i need a large but it would get wet in the shower so i keep a medium and as you can see my edges still be out because they be playing hating carefully they be playing hating and i just throw away the hair in my trash can and I really like that kiss spray more than even, honestly. I will say that. More than even. Um, I'm just picking up hair. So, yeah, the only thing about having the scissors, you have to clean your room a lot. I will say that. Listen, we gotta get off because <laughs> it's getting too serious. It's getting too serious. So now, what I'm gonna do, I'm going to check the time. I'm going to take a shower and brush my teeth because I just ate. They look white, but they don't seem like all the way. But compared to how much stuff I ate today, how much coffee and pop I had, they look pretty good. And I use this and um, my good stuff. The well, no, okay, yeah, by Laura Marcier. 
for my um my wig because this side is more sparse so she plucked it pretty much to mimic what my scalp looked like not my scalp but my edges so that's what i used to conceal the lace so it don't look like screen door but yeah that's all i gotta say um any longer y'all gonna kill me <laughs> so i'm just gonna take a good shower brush my teeth um drink some water and just relax and go to bed and get ready for work in the morning so yeah thanks for watching peace